Hi, my name is Lauren Cross, and I'm the owner of Girl Please Apparel. Uh, I've been in business with Girl Please since 2007. Well, Coveted House California is an organization that uh, assists uh, youth in transitioning from being homeless to uh, getting jobs and uh, kind of working their way back into society. Yeah. I became affiliated with them uh, through Hope Lutheran Church. Uh, Sister Margaret, she is the, uh, I guess you would say she's the head sister at Covenant House California that brings the uh, teens to hope. And uh, in conversation, I was speaking with her, and she mentioned that uh, undergarments were kind of a struggle for them. Uh, we were talking about my company and what I did, and I was like, well, I make t-shirts and underwear and socks and those type of items. She goes, wow, we really need those type of things, and sometimes we actually have to go buy those type of items to you know, give to one of the clients uh, because they don't have a resource for them. So that's what inspired me to work with her and do some benefits and fundraisers to uh, raise money so I could donate the items that they needed. As far as uh, Covenant House and uh, the circumstances by which many of the clients are there are, are very varied, but I know quite a few of them have been gay or uh, bisexual or transgender and they've been thrown out of their homes. That is a common scenario or even just not fitting in you know and being heterosexual or whatever there are many things that take people down the wrong road especially youth uh, there's alcoholism in families so uh, it's it's touching when I hear the varied stories you know whether it be you know family issues or personal issues that led them there we just have to let them know that it's not their fault and to support them. And if I can support them by giving them bras or panties or underwear or socks, then hey, I'm willing to do it. Well, the One Dream would really be able to get a tight network of organizations that I could really help on a regular basis. So right now it's about reaching out and getting that network of organizations that I can consistently help. Yes, one of the fundraisers that I actually did for Covenant House was called Don't Stop Till You Give Enough. And it was Michael Jackson inspired. I brought in a live band and singers, dancers, and uh, spokesmodels as well to come in and throw a big party and to raise money for Covenant House California. That was very successful. And we